All right, tonight's pre-Thanksgiving Eve video, as it darkens too much to be outside, uh, I totally fucked up. I, I got cute and was going to try and cut this, trim this off, and it started okay, and then the blade just choked. This is just such dense wood. It's just too much at, you know, four inches, three and three quarter inches tall for the blade to chop through so i use the other leftover piece which will be my bottom which will actually work out good i cut the ends on both sides to the desired uh, size i wanted i also did the um, nuts and uh, i welded the nuts on and now i will glue those so that those will sit flush and never move and then it will be ready for gluing and my final dado across the middle because of that one that I will cover with uh, hopefully some oak. So we'll see how that goes. Uh, minor, minor, minor update. Uh, but that's kind of what it's looking like. A little offsided because I need to get that glued in and sunk because of the pressure. But uh, looks nice. Coming out good. Good evening, YouTubers. Reloading bench back with you once again. So we did the glue, let that set for a little over a day. And I'm glad I decided. So originally I was going to do the dado, probably helps if I'm in screen. I was going to do the dado across there to cover that. But I have since decided that I think I would like to do the dado on all four sides just to give it some. Uh, unique offset uh, that's what it looks like now and uh, what I'm gonna do with the miter is cut that really quickly because sanding this much or that much hardwood is no bueno this much not a problem I specifically left overhang on the ends and a little bit on the sides so that uh, sanding would not be an issue but that's the next step. All right, function wise, function and form wise, well, maybe not so much form. Function and, yeah, let's go with function form. So we are cut, we are smooth. We are cut, we are smooth. Cut smooth, cut smooth. And everything is good on the bottom. I'll probably put some rubber feet. So form wise, square with holes function wise bar everything in its permanent state is complete and next we will it's getting a little too dark tonight so we'll do this over the weekend uh, we will cut this dado and uh, that will be a a nice oak insert that uh, serves as two purposes one to eliminate this line and two, give it another flavor once these uh, two woods are treated with teak oil to give them a much richer finish and then offset with a lighter oak, which I think will be uh, a nice pop. And then uh, I will go in and do the holes with the teak oil. So, yeah, liking how it's coming out. Looking good. So, smooth sailing for now. More to come.